Okay, Polly Anderson with uh, demonstrating the safe use of a bill hook. We personally don't use bill hooks very much in our forest school, but we can use them. We can use them with groups. Um, we would always start with a tool talk and expect the group to be able to remember the points of the tool talk before they're allowed to use the tool. We use them in partners. This is the tool talk. So this is my bill hook. This is the cover. I take the cover off like this. This is the blade and this is the cutting edge. When I'm not, uh, not using the bill hook, put the cover back on like this. I stand with the bill hook like this. I walk with the bill hook like this. I pass the bill hook like this. I use the bill hook two arms and a tool's length away from anybody else apart from my partner. I use the bill hook to cleave or split wood. I do not wear gloves on my uh, on either hand while I'm using the bill hook. When I'm not using it, but I might use it again in a minute, I put it on the ground with the handle facing forward, handle facing forward and the blade facing in. And when I finish using it completely, I put it in the designated space or toolbox. I'm going to show how to how we would use the bill hook to um, carry on making my mallet. Take the cover off. We're safe enough away. Place the bill hook on the top of this log. The, the bow saw cut is around the bottom here, and the aim of the bill hook is to cleave to where we cut with the bow saw. Okay. Right. You ready? Yes. How hard? Uh, hard. How many times? Twice. Excellent. Okay. I'll have to uh, do that bit again in a minute. Move round. How hard? Same again. You ready? Yes. One or two? Uh, two. Okay. Really? Are you ready? Yes. How many times? Uh, twice hard, please. Try one more, medium. And oh, we've got an interesting piece of wood. Oh, well done. Okay. Do one more on this one. Okay. Uh, yeah, one's hard, please. Ready? Yes. our bill hook away for now come back to this and put our bill hook away in yeah. the designated toolbox well done thank you